Should we use this as a clapper wound? Yeah. Grimfest. Don't, don't get don't get punching Grimfest. No, you don't. You don't. You don't. <laughs> nah, it's all good, mate. It's all good. Fun. So I'm, I'm melting. I'm, I, well, I'm not melting. I'm Stuart. <laughs> no, no, you're well, melting. I am melting. Yes. So uh, I have come from about an hour and I was in north of Manchester mm -hmm. on a train mm -hmm. into the hotel. Big queue. So I'm like, oh, where have you come from? Malibu. When did you on start? time. When did you? On time. Oh, <laughs> this is Everyone's picking on me today. No, 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 not because of me, because of the real name. Was on time. So, when did you set off? You, you just arrived today? Or? Today? Just uh, like uh, some hours ago. I well, look at how calm and calm. I'm, I'm melting. I'm yes, like, because I, I, I took a sour. And all this is that what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I look like. Have you ever seen Midnight Express? No, it was. When you're trying to smuggle heroin through the Turkish uh, airport, you start sweating. That's. <laughs> <laughs> we, I was I was just uh, spending the, the morning uh, walking around the city centre. What do you think? Center. What do you think of Manchester? Well, it's quite nice. I don't know. I mean, the, the, when, I, when I said to people that I'm going to travel to, to Manchester, they said, well, there's nothing to see there. <laughs> it's okay. There is quite some things. I visit the interior of the building of the this uh, this big theatre, uh, what is this change? Mm -hmm. Royal Theatre, and yeah. it's very interesting the, the building inside, this kind of circular theatre with crystals all around, and this mm -hmm. structure, all the things. Probably maybe about 10 minutes walk from here, there's a big town hall. Uh -huh. The town hall they used to shoot some of the scenes in Robert Downey Jr. and Sherlock Holmes. Ah. So I've, I finished work one day a few years, many years ago, and it was all kitted out like old Victorian farms and I enjoy the morning walking through the city centre. Yeah, Manchester's yeah. nice. Yeah. And it's also like it's just not quite big. I don't think you can walk yeah. all the city centre. It's easy. Lots of places to eat. So, yes. Uh, well, I would walk around Manchester today, but I'm busy watching a bunch of films, which includes. Okay. What have you, you, you watch it, You watch it today morning. No, I'm watching it tonight. Ah. I, did, I did get the chance to watch it. Ah, you didn't have the chance. Simeon from Grimfest, he said, have you watched Passenger? I'm like, no. It's like, you can know your interview. And I'm like, yes, but people haven't seen the film yet on the big screen. Well, probably this is the like interview number 190 that I do for the, for the passenger. Then I can do the answers and questions by my own. Well, let's, let's, <laughs> let's talk interviews then. So I watched the trailer for The Passenger last night. And I didn't watch it on purpose, the movie, because I ah. like to go into, you know, it's, it's a theater. choice between watching it on a television. Well, if you have, if you have a choice to watch it in a theater, it's a yes. place. It's a place. We, 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 we made a, a really hard work, uh, focused in the, in the post-production, coloring, uh, effects, and, and sound editing and sound design mm -hmm. in order to enjoy it mm -hmm. and to be enjoyable in a movie theater. Mm -hmm. Then, if you have the opportunity to watch it today, yeah. night is, is better than if you watch it. Exactly. Today morning at home or into an iPad or something like that because the the movie is uh, shooting in anamorphic <coughs> then the screen the big screen is where you really feel and enjoy the, the work. I don't understand these people who watch films on the phones. Yeah. I, just, I know you're not like well, can't struggle with people, but and do not do, 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 do not talk about these people that uh, made this uh, that or. Uh, that they multiply the the, oh, the, the, the speed. The, the speed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's crazy. Yeah, and they, 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 they watch the things per, per two in order to 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 to, uh, to reduce the timing that they are watching and they, the sounds and everything it's so more it's, like, it's, like, it's like it's like Benny Hill. Yeah. I don't know. It's a bit like you buy a music album. So Fernando releases a music album you go, Do you know what if you listen to track number one, track number twelve you Listen to it in eight minutes. Skip all the bits in the middle. No, yes. listen, listen to it all. Yeah, or it's, watch it all. It's crazy, but yeah. I, I, I think they need to erase the possibility to do that in the I thought you were going to say the people that do it, which I would. I feel like I secretly vote for that. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Sweet. It's crazy. It's crazy. Right, okay. So are you looking forward to, I mean, you've done a lot of these interviews for the passenger. Uh, how, what's your favourite type of question to be asked? Is there, is there uh, one that stands above all the others? I mean, we, 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 we uh, well, uh, normally we uh, see that it's, it's, there's like a common question. It's like a work, a working idea, uh, 
about how we work together because we are two directors and how we work together. It's like a some plots uh, that it's always repeat and repeat, but I mean, we, we have like no, no favorite questions. Mm -hmm. uh, we answer everything with our best uh, words and we do our best to, to have to do something different in every interview, but then you feel that you are answering the same again and again and again, and you feel like stupid. It's a, it's a feeling that when you do a lot of interviews in one day for yeah. the same thing, you, you, you try to be like, a, to do something different in every interview, but it's not possible because they are, they are, they are, they are doing the same yeah. questions. <laughs> but, you, but you feel that you have to do something different, yeah. but it doesn't matter you can answer exactly the same to one journalist to the other because it's the same question. Mm -hmm. Then, then at, at, the last, the, the, at the last interviews, you always uh, feel that you're repeating and, and you try to be original, but you probably you are messing up. In this day and age, it's like something's filmed or whatever, and you mess it up, you're like, oh no, that's not going to happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In 20 years' time, someone's going to be like, what the hell yeah. is well, who, who knows? Who knows? Who knows? We, are, we already did a lot of interviews because the passing year started uh, its uh, festival Smash. trip, like last year, in yeah. Sitges. Then the the movie it's now uh, it's now one year uh, through the world mm -hmm. sending to to some a lot of film festivals and we are lucky we are having a lot of uh, Twitter selection and, and we are enjoying a lot of festivals and and a lot of people is watching the movie in, in festivals. Yeah. Here is a UK premiere. Yeah. The, the first time it's going to be able to watch in the UK. And is this your it's your first time Green Fest? Yeah, yeah they're, awesome. like, they're a great bunch. They really are. I've attended, I think, maybe four or five films. The previous two I did virtually, mm -hmm. which was quite nice for me because I could just sit at home and do, you know, Skype interviews. And yeah, that was great. Yeah. But then you miss the whole, you miss watching the film on big screen. Yeah. You miss, you yeah. miss being surrounded by like-minded film geeks. I, 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 I've been telling, I've been telling just uh, Rachel when we watched coming mm. to the hotel from the airport. Uh, that I always, me and Raul, we always stay at the theater with the audience yeah. to watch the movie. I don't know how many times we are already watching the movie, it's crazy, but we always like to stay because in every country we watch the movie with different audience, we feel different. Mm -hmm. There's like some jokes that the people enjoy or not, in different, because cultural questions or whatever. And it's nice to, to watch like in Belgium and in the UK and then and in South America or the United States. Do you then take you sit there with no like, oh, Manchester likes this type of thing, but mentally, do you take note of what certain countries no. that influence the next film, which I know you're onto anyway? Because I've seen no, 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 no. I mean, we, we, ha we have like our own view of what we want to do and what history we want to, to tell, to shoot, and, and I mean, it's not because we, we learn a lot, uh, uh, but it's not as like a, as an influence in, in what are you going to do, but probably there is some things that you are starting to, to, to notice that works like globally. Mm -hmm. And you know that there is, we know that there's some jokes in the movie that works globally and others are not local jokes. No then yes, when, when probably when you are planning to do something that you want to export globally, you, you need to think about okay, remember the passing year, remember that these kind of jokes are not going to work. I want it to move more, more through this kind of thing. And is there a big difference from country to country? So obviously don't spoil it because I'm watching it tonight. But is there something that, you know, one country may laugh or, or jump at in the passing year that another one just totally, they, they don't and, and vice versa? Well, not exactly, but there is, there is a, a concrete uh, joke, not joke, like a moment in the movie mm -hmm. that we want like, to express something. And, 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 and we was like visiting like a lot of film festivals and no one in those screenings. We, we didn't feel nothing in that moment. Oh, no. But uh, curious, in Belgium, who was at the beef, mm -hmm. uh, was a, like a big uh, theater, it's 1,300 people. Mm -hmm. and, and in that moment, we feel exactly that we want to transmit. Mm -hmm. it was, they said, it's curious. In Belgium. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but, 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 but not somebody, in the States. At least somebody got it. You're like, yes, it does work. Yes, it's not that being Raoul. No, we, I, we, we know that the moment worked, but we, we thought that the moment could be like more emotional. 
and we, we didn't feel we were going to make the festival, but finally we, we felt in the in the beat. So <laughs> what's your favorite thing about the film festival circuit in general? I mean you may have answered it already with watching the audience and react in different ways, but Great Festival talking to me a couple of weeks back and they were they were keen to get a, a bit of feedback on the the community side of film festivals. Mm -hmm. Because a lot of people they look at the film title and go, horror film. Or you know some of what sort of films you make? I make this, you know, Passenger yeah. and it looks grisly and there's a scary bit in it. And they go, yeah. Oof, what does that say about you? So they're trying to work out you know, a good way to sort of bring the community aspect to it. So what do you love about it most? Uh, in film festival, depending on the kind of film festival, it's like a big film festival. The end of film festivals are now like in this industry part. Then then you 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 attend the festival because you are doing like a Amplify your networking and, and, and then new people, and then in order to grow professional in a professional way. Uh, but mostly, uh, we, we as, as I told you, we, we enjoy a lot the, to be in the theater with a different audience and then uh, feel the different feelings and, mm -hmm. and the reaction from the audience. Is, is and probably is the, the thing that we enjoy most. You can't replicate that to all the time. You can if you know, like two or three of you watching it. Did you like it? But there's nothing like an auditorium. Yeah, there's like nothing. People nothing. Eat popcorn, and throw popcorn up and and it's 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 there's nothing, there's nothing like that. 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 There's a very famous film festival in Spain, I don't know, in Spain, in San Sebastián, Donosti. There's like a general film festival, it's the San Sebastián Film Festival, it's international, well known. But there's another one, which is Genoa. The Genoa, the fantastic week. It's a week and it's only seven films, one per day. And the festival is famous because the audience uh, insult and, yeah. and, 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 no. and, and, and scream <laughs> and during the the screening, but they 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 did in a, they do in an intelligent way. You know, then then it's it's nice to be there in, and and very enjoyable how jokes they introduce in certain points of the movie. And because of the passion, it is like a. It's an adventure movie, it's a fantasy movie, but also it's a black comedy in, in, in moments. You cannot define it. Okay, it's, it's terrible, yes, but it's more like a fantasy adventure. And, and because of this, uh, I remember this screen that we really warm and really enjoyable screening because of that jokes in certain moments was really nice and fun. Can't wait to watch. I think it's four to eleven or half past ten tonight. I will be sitting there in whichever, whichever auditorium it is, and you'll be at the screen and obviously watching the audience. Uh, I wouldn't there. I wouldn't there. We're gonna do a, like a small introduction, and then I think I need to do some things during the screen with the people mm -hmm. of the festival. But uh, in the moment we finish, I came back to the theatre because I, I always enjoy watching the movie. I always enjoy watching the movie as well. I love. Nice. International poster. The international the poster. International poster. Uh, and it's my type of film, so I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, to they, they define it like a mix in between, I don't know if you know about Langa, but Langa is a very well known director from Spain that made like this daily comedy. Mm -hmm. And it's a mix in between Berlanga, Carpenter, and Kronenberg. And then all the mix, yeah. probably the most, the biggest influences in the, in the movies, uh, Carpenter uh, movies. Uh, the thing is probably the the main influence, uh, Hidden Devil from Sam Raimi also, but I, I mean, uh, we, we, we don't like like have like a in reference or like uh, focusing the reference, we, 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 we have this like uh, unconscious uh, references, it's like uh, you've been watching movies all your life, then probably you have like this remembrance, it's something inside, but you are not, you don't really know that you are applying these influences, it's like unconscious. Mm -hmm. And then when you watch it finish, you say, ah, here is Carpenter. But not because when we were shooting, we said, this one to do like Carpenter. Yes, probably. Carpenter, Cronenberg. Uh, it's it's inside, it's, it's inside yeah. because you, you've you been watching, I mean, in Spielberg, yeah. uh, you've been watching all these movies and then there is something that when you are doing the plan with Raul and I, we are um, obsessed with the planification. I mean, every shot in the movie, it's, uh, it's planned. There is no improvi improvi improvise. Mm -hmm. we, we, we never improvise. Only, I mean, as you know, 
I said it's like an animal life. Um, things happen, and okay, in a moment you, you cannot cover as you wish, and you need to replan and do something in a moment. But uh, we also go apart and we talk and we, we redesign the, the systems, and then everything is, is planned and we, it's our way of work. Um, thank you for coming along to, to the festival as well. It's, it, this is one of the reasons I've missed doing all the in-person group festivals like this event with filmmakers. Um, so thank you for making what I'm sure is an amazing film. And uh, I will probably see you later on tonight and say it wasn't. Well, I really well, enjoyed it. Or not. Yeah, I'll be like, you can, not, you, can, you, you can throw things when I yeah. came to the stage. Is there any favourite insult you like? Or shall I just make No, uh, well, throw me some cakes. I'll say so. Or, 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 or what is it? Cinnamon rolls or something like that. I'll get those. Sure. Yeah, I'll get six, some. But thank you. Thank <laughs> you very, very much. Yeah. Can I get you to sign the poster? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Oh, it's a nice paper. It is. Huh. You want silver or black? I think, uh, depending, if we see a seer, silver is going to work mm -hmm. better if you want here, if you want here or here. Because yours is zooming in. I'll probably I'll probably here, here but much better. Let me see if it's working. You didn't overrun too much, only by. It's like a little bit dry. Nothing else planned other than some interviews and watching lots of movies. It's not the best thing that I ever did, but because because it's dry, it's not my fault. Blame the pain. Blame the pain. <laughs> Blame the pain. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, you will. I will stare at you in, and you've got some. Yeah. What are you doing now? You can't talk to me, I'm afraid. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay. We can go wherever we can stay safe. ¿Va a coger a Nacional? ¿Qué pasa? ¿No os gusta el paisaje? ¡Pasa! ¡Cuidado! ¡Cómo se me cago! ¡Hostia! ¡Hostia! Dime, por favor, que no le he matado. Apuntarte al gimnasio. No, no, si apuntado estoy. Lo que me falta es ir. ¡Ah!